kiddos. This time, I need you to bring your workbook. We are going to do the workbook. Yes. Open it to page 80. Page 80. You're done opening it? Okay. We have here Alivator. Alivator. What's the title of the poem? Alivator. Alivator. The title of the poem is Alivator. Alivator. Elevator. Okay, now children, look at the children at the bottom of the picture. You can see three children. Now we are going to start reading the poem from there. Okay, from below. From below. We are going to start reading from the children until we go up. Okay? So, beware the alligator if you see one in a shop. He will let you ride upon his back, then eat you at the top. So, where do we begin? We begin below. Again, we are going to read it again. Let's start again. Beware the elevator. If you see one in a shop, he will let you ride upon his back. Then eat you at the top. Done reading? Okay, this what reminds you of this alligator? Yes, I know it is an alligator. How does it look like, you know, when you are going up? It's tail, okay, it's just like a staircase, right? It's like a staircase. Okay, you can see here, this is the back of the elevator. Okay, it's spiny, this back. Okay, hmm, elevator, it is like an escalator, okay, or escalator, you know, escalator, once you visit any mall, you are going to find this electric, you know, elevator, uh, escalator, I mean escalator, this one, to bring you up to your destination. For example, you are on the ground floor and you need to go to the third floor. So it's a long way of climbing, right? So this we call this escalator, okay, escalator, like this, elevator. Like this, elevator. Is there any question here? Let's go to the next page. Okay. Mm, before I forgot, it is written by Roger McGo. It is written by Roger McGo. Okay, let's go up, up, up to the next page. We are going to answer the questions here. Let's put it down. Okay, page 81. Turn the page 31, 81. Sorry, page 81. So we have to respond here, and here we have the following questions. Number one question. 
Where might you see the elevator? Where might you see the elevator? I'm sorry. Where might you see the elevator? Where? That's why exactly what I told you. Escalator. Where? Huh? In the where? Huh? Huh? In the shop, yes. In the shop. Number two. Hmm. Where will the elevator let you ride? Where will the elevator let you ride? Where? Which part? Mm. Elevator will let you ride where? Mm. On his back. Mm. Number three question. What will happen at the top? Once you reach the top, what will happen at the top? Mm. It will mm, eat you. Very good. Let's read again the questions. Where might you see the elevator? In the shop. Where will the elevator let you ride? On his back. What will happen at the top? Once you reach the top, it will eat you. Okay, that's great. Are you done to this? Let's go to the question B. Hmm. You're done? Okay. B question. Uh oh, where's my page? Okay. Elevator. We have here. Elevator is a made up word. Okay, it is a made-up word, as I told you. Which two words are put together to make it? Hmm. And then, we are going to take the correct answer from the following. Hmm. Is it alligator and stairs? Mm. No, very good. So it's not. So, next, is it alligator and elevator? Yes. Okay. Elevator or escalator, it's almost the same. Okay, next. We have an elevator here in Antita. No, so those are not. Okay, it's a question. Why do you think the pot has set out the poem the way he has? Why does it start at the bottom? Why? Mm. Yes, this is gonna be sure. I need you. No, it's not a classwork, it's a homework. Uh oh. Uh oh. Let's erase it. Okay. We have.
have this as your homework. Homework. Because I need you to, to write your own ideas here. Okay, you're done here, grades. Kiddos. Okay, let's erase everything. And then, let me check. We are going. Is there any more? No more. So that's it for now. We're done. Answering page 81. So I need you to reread it again. We read The Elevator is a very nice poem. You're gonna like it. So that's it for now. Goodbye. Stay safe.